new technology helping keep the lights on. Which is better for us, safer, more effective, gets the power back on more quickly. The high-tech way NV Energy is keeping an eye on power lines in remote areas, helping pinpoint exactly where outages strike. Now, live, this is 8 News Now at 6. NV Energy is doing something new. They're installing sensors on some of their remote power lines. And those sensors will immediately alert them if there's an outage, some other kind of problem. Paul Johnsich was uh, with one of the crews up on Mount Charleston this morning. Huh? You've no doubt heard the age-old question, when a tree falls in the forest and there's no one around to hear it, does it make a sound? <laughs> right. right. Well, uh, NV Energy will most certainly hear it whenever anything falls on their power lines. At least they'll know it because these relatively low-cost sensors you're about to see will immediately tell them where there's a problem. They can also communicate additional information about maintenance issues with the power flow. This morning, crews installed the sensors on lines near Mount Charleston, lines that carry 34,000 volts of electricity, and they can do it without interrupting power. According to the Department of Energy, NV Energy has some of the best reliability and fewest interruptions in the country. This should make them even better. In my mind, one of the best things we get out of it is it tells us about the quality of the power going through, it allows us to de decide whether we need to do some preventative maintenance so that we can avoid an outage. It can kind of um, triangulate and tell us where the outage is so that we can get a crew in there more quickly, which is better for us, safer, more effective, gets the power back on more quickly. Today, that uh, drone you saw was used to get a bird's eye view of the work that was being done. NV Energy hopes to complete installation of the sensors throughout the state by the end of the year. And with 45,000 square miles of service area, NV Energy has uh, power lines and substations in some very remote locations. And this will make it easier, more cost efficient to monitor everything, which until now had to be eyeballed by employees who had to drive some very long distances. Dave?